Hi there. Uh, we are going to do hypopressives with a high lunge position. This is great for rectal type um, prolapse symptoms and rectocele symptoms and just general overall pelvic lift in general because it incorporates so much full body muscle activity and that wonderful low level pelvic floor engagement and we get the added lift as well with the hypopressive. Okay, so we're going to start with about a hand width between your feet. Let's get slightly soft in the knees. Think about stacking ribs over hips, over feet. Stacking head over top of your shoulders. Your chin is just very lightly dipped, so the crown of the head reaches up slightly. Palms are in front of the hips. Take a deep inhale here. Exhale, step one leg forward. Both feet are flat. Inhale here. Exhale, settle in, sending your hands to the front of your thigh. Think about a long spine from hip through crown of your head. Inhale here. Exhale here. Soften the belly slightly if you need to, and then stretch the ribs out to your side. Stretch, stretch, reach, 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 and then float your arms forward and up. Only float them so high that you can keep your ribs from flaring forward in space. Hold as long as you need to before you're gasping and then breathe in. Exhale, slowly float back to start. Second side, assume your position. Knees are ever so slightly soft. You're reaching lightly upward through the crown of your head. All your major joints in your body are stacked. Inhale. Exhale, step the opposite foot forward. Both feet are flat on the earth. Inhale here. Exhale, place those hands stacked up toward the end of your thigh. Inhale here. Long spine. Exhale. Soften the belly very slightly and then stretch those ribs out to the sides and float those hands forward and up until you feel like your ribs are going to flare. Hold here for as long as you can, breathing before you're actually gasping. Slowly step back to start. So we would do that three times per side. If you have any questions, come see me.